Day 46 in the 1971 Mustang Fastback Restoration Project. I am here with Carl and Ricky. Carl. Ricky's the other way. And Ricky. And we are, well, now you got vertigo. We are um, getting silver paint, and we're going to actually paint the top of that tank. We buffed it. We started to buff it out. We're not pleased with the results, so we're going to go silver on the bottom. And we're going to go undercoat black on the top of the tank. We've got the sending unit, and we've got the straps already painted black. So today, looks like gas tank's going in on the car. And we'll see what else we can do, because I've been giving these summaries, guys. And every time I give you a summary, I, I don't get everything done. And I'm sorry for that. We are Our intentions are to get everything done that we plan on in the morning. But it's taking a little bit little longer to get it done. So uh, we're getting the paint, and we're all possibly getting that uh, master finally. And uh, we should be able to get those installed today. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you at Mustang Medic. Thank you. Rick, Carl. Dot com. Thank okay. you. All right. Jeez. Even the Chevy guy says. Oh, Chevy. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait, wait. Let me show you real quick over my shoulder here. I'm at Carl's shop, Dianca's uh, Collision in uh, Palm Springs. No, no, Cathedral City. Palm Springs. Palm Springs? Yes. And look, he's got, look, he's got a Chevy logo right here. Look at this. Isn't that cute? Chevy logo. Well, guess what I'm going to do? To, guess what I'm going to do to the Mustang Medic truck? I think I'm going to put slow moving vehicle on the back. Stay back 500 feet. <laughs> I better be careful. I don't want. I don't want to egg on these Chevy guys too much. But we just thought that'd be funny. It was a thought. Random thought. Got a price for the uh, decals and everything on the Mustang Medic truck. Cha ching. We got to sell that 71. So we'll uh, continue to uh, deck her out and keep pushing forward. Again, appreciate you guys watching. Thanks. You guys asked for Mustangs. You asked for hot chicks. There's my wife. There you go. There's the, people, a lot of people have been requesting that my wife get shown on video. So there's one for uh, the guys. <laughs> All right. So we are going to do, we are, our focus is gas tank today. Gas tank, gas tank, gas tank, gas tank, gas tank, gas tank. So I want to show you the last view of the gas tank area before we put it in. So you guys have a sense of just how beautiful the detail is on this car. So this is the view of the bottom area of where the tank goes. <laughs> and we're going to be putting her in shortly. There's the gas line over there. And I'm being told on these plates that these are correct. This is a correct angle in that bolted up. So. We're also going to be securing the uh, back shocks back in too uh, before we put the tank in. And the straps have also been painted, and here are the straps. Here's a, a shot of those straps that have been planted, sanded down and painted black. They'll look nice. They'll be a nice contrast off the silver tank. We're going to show them the top side of the tank right now so they can see what it's going to look like above the tank. We've undercoated the top part of the tank. Now flip it back. And now we've sanded down and we are going to silver paint this thing. We're not going to go for brushed aluminum. We decided we got this great uh, silver paint. So we're just going to paint the bottom of this tank and strap it up. So next you will see this all nice and silver on this side. We're just going to mask off the bottom, paint the top. It's hot. It's hot. Yeah. Did some shopping on eBay for these hinges and I was blown away to see them for three hundred and fifty dollars so you if you don't have these hinges for your 71 or you see them in a junkyard and get them cheap I grab them <laughs> because they are selling these hinges for a 71 to 73 for close to three hundred and fifty to four hundred dollars that's a lot that's a lot of uh, buckos so we're fortunate to have them. We are looking for the springs. We've got one spring. Need to get the other ones. 
Ricky's sanding them down, wire reeling them. And uh, let's take you over to the gas tank so you can take a peek at that. We are putting up, um, we're closing this up in preparation for painting the uh, 69, which should be happening Friday or Saturday. We're going to be uh, doing final sanding on that, masking her off, spraying her with a white primer coat. And we are also going to be changing out the calipers, the final th piece on that. So if you're doing your brake jobs, it seems like you might as well just do it all. Here's the gas tank. What do you guys think? There's the black primer side, and there's the bottom silver side. We're about to put the sending unit in right now. We're also going to be putting in the vent, and then this hole obviously lines up with the inlet for the gas. So, I think she's ready to go. We might give her one more coat. She's pretty bright and shiny. I didn't, wasn't prepared for her to be this shiny with this silver paint. I'm thinking about doing the same color as the power booster instead. Let me know what you guys think. I might sit on it for a day and then make a decision because uh, we need to get more, more silver paint anyway. This color or go with the bright tank and then the black straps I guess will be here and here. If you appreciate our efforts and caught the vision of Mustang Medic, please send a donation for the cause via PayPal. Our PayPal email address is paypal at mustangmedic.com. It's always appreciated. Thank you. We're also putting the gas pedal in today, too. We're with Sky again of Vivid Graphics. He's back. Vivid Graphics? Vivid? Graphic design. Vivid Graphic Design. And he, this is how you remove vinyl letters. We don't recommend you do this at home. But uh, he's plucking his letter for letter. I'm peeling this off. Uh, it turned out the white search just obviously is not working when it's not on a ba black background. And Sky has enlarged it, and it's going red, blue, red, blue. Or blue, red, blue, red. <laughs> blue, red, blue, red. Matching the colors of the Mustang Medic logo. He, uh, his uh, company is going to be styling out all the side graphics. They're going to be here. I've showed this to you on a couple concept videos. And but we've got a new, we're going to put a 09 on here too. We're going to be talking to Sky about that. But we're going to be putting a stripe on the front of the truck. I think I'm going to leave the GMC logo on the truck just because it gets funnier and funnier as I, as we put these graphics on. But we're going to put a big old, uh, Star of Life with a pony and blue uh, shell, Shelby stripes up and over the back of the truck. Could have put a 09 on the doors and on the side. That there's Ricky again, shirtless in Palm Springs, always a dangerous thing. And uh, we will uh, show you the install of the new lettering, new large lettering on the back. Just keeping you guys apprised of what we're doing. And uh, we really appreciate you guys putting the word out over there at 5.0 Magazine. Thank you, William, both Williams. And thank you for all the threads and spreading the word on Facebook, guys. We really appreciate it. This guy got it done. Check it out. There it is. Doesn't he do nice work? Ford Mustang Search and Rescue. Thank you, Sky. You're welcome. Appreciate it. No problem. All right. Digging it. It's coming along. It's coming along. All right, so Sky, a fellow art director like me, thinks that this thing is just too bright silver. I'm going to talk to Carl about it. I kind of just think this thing is just too darn bright. I mean, what do you guys think? We were thinking about doing it this way. That kind of silver. All right, give me your opinion. Thank you, Sky. Yeah, no problem. All right, it's got Vivid Graphics, and we're out of Palm Springs. Palm Springs. What's your website? VividGraphicDesigns.com. VividGraphicDesigns.com. Yes, sir. Got it. There you go. You can see his work. You know, suddenly it's growing on me, this detail of the black and the silver. It's a tough decision today. I don't know. I must be tired. You guys make the decision for me. Vote tonight on this video. Darker silver or just leave her as she stands. Put the black straps on her and strap her in. I'm leaning that way. Thanks for watching. Look for the link in the description for the next in our series. If it's not there, come back soon. MustangMedic.com. MustangMedic.com.